Hey what's up guys welcome to fine gap youtube channel and in today's video i will teach you how you can create this type of circular cards using html and css only and in this video you will learn an important concept that how to use multiple box shadow values to create this type of shadow so friends video is going to be more important and before start please i request you to subscribe to our youtube channel to stay up to date with amazing web designing videos let's start so friends first of all you can see that i have two files in my project folder the one is index.html and the second is style.css so first of all we have to create a simple html structure in the index.html and then we will link our css file with our this html code then inside the body element type here div.container and create another div with class draw inside this i will create a p element and type here html then simply co copy this and paste this here and i will type here css next we have to type here span type here plus copy the span element and paste this element here and type here equal to and then we again have to copy this drop class div and paste this div here at from at this css word i will remove this and we have to use a font awesome icon here to add the font awesome cdn in your website just search here font awesome cdn click on this first website cdnjs.com click on this copy link tag and paste this inside your head section now you can use the font awesome icons now i will type here class not class but i will type here i then class fa fa hurt so friends you can see the current output i will zoom it a little bit then open the style.css and type here star padding zero margin zero and box sizing border box then from index.html copy this body element and paste this element here and type display flex justify content center align item center minimum height 100 vh and background color hash triple e so by writing these four lines your this container div will move exactly at the center position of your screen next copy this container class and paste this class here with a dot and type display flex justify content center and align item center then copy this container class and paste here and then from your index.html copy this pen element and paste this element here and then type here font size 2.5 em justify content center and align item so we have to remove these two properties and type here margin 0 and 20 pixel we have to type the container class here so now you can see that your these words and symbols are in a same line then copy this container class and paste this class here and then type dot drop the dot drop class is exist at this position we have assigned this class to this div and then type here width 100 pixel 150 pixel and then type here height 150 pixel background color white I will zoom out this a little bit display flex justify content center align item center and border radius 50 percent margin 0 and 10 pixel position relative text shadow minus 2 pixel minus 2 pixel 5 pixel and type this color code friend this is the main part of the video now we have to add shadow to our this card and I will use multiple shadow properties to create that shadow so first of all i will type here filter and then type here drop shadow and type these values 4 pixel 4 pixel 10 pixel and color would be white and then again type here box shadow and type these values rgba 0 0 0 and 0 0.1 and here i will type inset and then type comma and press enter 15 pixel 25 pixel 10 pixel rgba 0 0 0 and 0 0.05 again type here a comma and type these values like 15 pixel 20 pixel 20 pixel rgba and this color code again type here a comma and type these these values type this color code here so friends by writing these four shadow properties you will come up this output you can learn about how to use 
multiple css box shadow properties to understand this concept completely next we have to create a circular white color dot with a shadow here to do that i will copy these two classes and paste them here and then type double colon before content empty width 10 pixel height 10 pixel position absolute left 20 pixel top 40 pixel border radius 50 percent background color white box shadow 0 10 pixel 10 pixel and rgba 0 0 0 and 0 0.2 will be opacity so you can see a dot here and then i will type filter blur 2 pixel not 22 but 2 pixel and then from index.html copy this drop class and paste this class here with a dot and then copy this p element and paste here and type font size 1.7 em again type here dot drop and from here copy this fa heard class and paste this class here and type font size 1.7 em and color red so friends we have completed our css part by writing the css code you will come up this output i hope you must enjoy this video if you have any question you can ask us in the comment section we will try to answer your question and please subscribe to our youtube channel for future videos and finally thanks for watching